Mm -hmm. that, that I go deep into history to write because I can write, I can say whatever I want about people. Mm -hmm. And I go, well, yeah, okay, so when, when do you have any obligation to the facts? Mm -hmm. When do you have any obligation to the historical characters? Are there obligation to historical characters when you write? I mean, Mark says no, right? Mm -hmm. Mark says no, so. I don't. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. I mean, I. I and I, you take what you want, I, I, and uh, you leave the rest mm -hmm. aside. You Doesn't take, you, you take the, the salient <sighs> points, the points that that uh, that uh, speak to you, and that that. Um, Doesn't that make you predators? Sure. Absolutely. Sure. <laughs> yeah. We're pickers and stealers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And also, too, I mean, I think I I would be lying if I said that um, I didn't want people to feel the same way about this historical person. I want you, I'm, I'm trying to make you see this historical person the way I see them. Mm -hmm. Not the objective or the way I think you should see them. I want you to see them the way I do. And I think that that's important for a playwright, to take a stand, to have an opinion, to... Yeah. Yes. But do you draw a line between actually manipulating history? No. 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 So you should be free to manipulate history. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Sure. <laughs> mm -hmm. Molly, you didn't answer. No, I, I agree with him. Or conversely, you could, should be free to be strict to history if it means you're demythifying somebody. So would you write a play that Preston Manning created Medicare? Absolutely. <laughs> be a comedy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It would be funny. It would be. <laughs> just uh, following up on what uh, Andrew just said uh, about theatre going across the country, I was at the, the tribute to Maver Moore last week and they had video clips of him and one of the clips that he ha had, apparently it's a famous quote, which I had only, I only heard last Monday night unfortunately, uh, he said that he thought there should be uh, theatre troops that travel across the country so that they would feel part of Canada and Canada would feel that they were part of them. Yeah. Um, and he said to do something like that would cost less than the cost of a new fighter jet. <laughs> and he said, it's not that I'm against national defense, I just want something, something to defend. Which Whoa, I thought was <laughs> very good. Okay. Um, good one of my other favorite quotes is that uh, history is a contrived corridor. And um, I think that uh, we've got some great contrivers here <laughs> mm. and you've made some pretty great corridors. Um, mm. So I want to thank everyone for coming on the panel. Um, thank you.